Welcome, Snack Attackers, to another interesting, weird product review. Now, I have actually only just kind of considered that you guys always know the title of the product, so me doing an explanation of the product or misleading on what it could be is uh, a, a fruitless bit. It has really no point. So I'm just going to show you the product and then discuss why it's weird to me. This is the brand new Bomb Pop Middles. I'm going to get this close to you so you guys can see what this is. Chocolate Caramel Sundae. Now, Bomb Pops, we all know what Bomb Pops are. They're the uh, originally cherry, lime, and blue raspberry ice pops or ice lollies, whatever you really want to call them. And they're, uh, they're kind of an, a, a staple of, of the uh, popsicle industry. Over the years, they've had many flavors, but they've never wavered from what they are, which is an ice pop. Not whatever this is, which is something entirely different. Because with a, with a gooey center, this is more like a, like a what, like a creamsicle? Like, it, it, it seems like a huge departure from norm. Now, they didn't release these in just this flavor. They have uh, three others, only one of which I found. Uh, the ch chocolate cream sandwich, which is one I found. S'mores and strawberry raspberry taffy. Of all of those, I'd like to try the strawberry raspberry taffy. I've not found them yet. Now these came out, and this is since I know what this what um, my schedule is and what products I have. You're about to see a lot of um, frozen desserts. That's because, baby, it's almost summer, and when the when the weather is warm, people want those cold things to cool down. I don't know if you know companies are thinking that far ahead. I think so. I think so. Now. There's not much more to say about these. I love the original Bomb Pops. I didn't like their Tropical, and I really like the Warhead version, which is, um, I'll show a picture of all of them here, or here, or maybe here. Probably here. That's me just <laughs> giving some time to, to put the box there. Um, yeah, there's, there's not much more to say about them. I love the original Bomb Pops. I don't... I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say because my editor's been calling me out that I've been uh, stating my opinion on chocolate, and yes, technically, referencing it by not referencing it is still referencing it, but, uh, you know, you know my opinions, there's no reason for me to keep getting into it. Let's, uh, let's get into this. I, again, this was during the time where I wasn't keeping track of where I was purchasing things, I know that this is going to be the way that the solo edited videos are going to look. So this is actually a continuation now of the of what shall be normal. Ooh, you love that noise, everyone? Mmm. Rest in peace, headphone users. Okay. Uh. <laughs> I'm gonna bring this close to you. It's the same texture of like fudge bars, you know? Like it, it's it's not an ice lot like fudge bars, those chocolate bars. I, I, I like I forget what they, they're called, everyone. I've got a terrible memory and Do I just bite this? Because the center's what's gonna be different, but like biting into ice things sucks. The things I do for you, the audience. Let's do it. Three, two, one, snack attack. The first bite was just chocolate, and it tastes exactly like one of those chocolate fudge bars. It's the same texture, it's the same mouthfeel, it's the same flavor. I'll show you guys each time, I don't know if you can tell. The next bite's gonna have the chewy caramel. I, I don't like that. It's the flavor is like a worst cho chocolate Wendy Frosty. Those are good. This is not. Okay. The caramel off offers a new mouthfeel. 
it's clear that there's a new texture, but the flavor really gets overpowered by the chocolate. In the... And kind of like the second wave of flavor, there's a little bit of caramel, but... Do I say caramel or caramel? Well, neither of those are how anyone says it. Caramel or caramel? Caramel. Caramel. That was pointless. Um... Yeah, it's, it's really not for me. Mmm. Oh. Ooh. It's so rich. It's so rich, it's too rich. This is like... Jeff Bezos level rich. Like, trillionaire, like, shouldn't exist, you know? Like, this is too rich. There's your political commentary for the day. Don't watch any more political commentary, that was it. You get one per day. Everyone knows that. This You squandered it. You you clicked on a Snack Attackers video. You didn't think you were going to get any political commentary, but then you got it. And now you can't have any more. No news. Don't you be cheating. Okay, I'm watching you. Well, is this a Snack Attack yes or a pass? This is a Snack Attack pass. Um, I think it should be clear why it is, in my opinion. However, if you like... Uh, ch chocolate bars, um, if you like chocolate, if you like richness, you'll like this. It's not for me. Uh, I give it a 3 out of 10. It'll, it'll cool you down on a hot day, it's just not a flavor I enjoy. But the question we ask around here, and the question I've been forgetting to ask recently, but now that I'm like back to form, I'm back to biz -ness, is would you buy it again? And the answer is obviously no. It's it, it has nothing for me. It offers me nothing but pain and little to no solace. Nothing but pain and little to no solace. So yeah, um, that's that's all I have to say, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Peace.